We're here with freshman midfielder Olivia Matson. After a, after a sweep this past weekend against Nichols and Southeastern, and then this upcoming week, uh, this upcoming Friday against uh, UCA. First, I mean, after several close chances uh, of getting that first goal, how did the field finally see it go in the back of the net? Uh, I was really happy. That felt like a big moment to me, and I was was happy that I was able to score my first college goal. Um, yeah. Then, uh, how did it feel knowing uh, your uh, teammates trusted you in that big moment with the penalty kick? Uh, they could choose. They could have chosen anyone, uh, but they decided to choose you. Yeah, no, that meant a lot to me, and and I'm I'm grateful for that trust that they have in me. Um, the same kind of trust that I have in, de in them. So I was that felt nice, and 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 I was happy about that. And then uh, then you guys have scored eight goals in the last three games. I mean, what's been the different? What's been the difference offensively from uh, the beginning of the year until now? I think we've been finding like good um, runs from the attackers, and we've practiced a lot of the the movement and the penetrating passes in in the midfield um, through the back line of the opponents. So I think that um, just having an attacking mindset and looking for options forward has been the the biggest change. And then, uh, I mean, as you wind down your freshman season, what do you where do you think your game game has improved from uh, earlier in the season? until now after gaining so much experience you mean for me personally yes uh, i think for me um the mental side of the game has been a big difference i'm being able to stay in the game for 90 minutes or more if necessary and i think that um just like being more physical has changed for me i'm using my body in different ways that i've been used to and um yeah just also like developing in the midfield um and also contributing to the back line when necessary. And then uh, UCA comes in desperate for a win, or, or at least a tie. So, what do you think? Some what do you? What are some of the challenges that they provide coming in, being so desperate, uh, desperate for points? What do you? What are some of the challenges they provide? Yeah, I think it's gonna be a matter of taking uh, control from the very start of the game. I think that's something that we're gonna have to make sure to to do and um, early on uh, take the control and don't let them pressure us in in any any way and just like staying compact and composed um, and just I guess play our our game and and keep on attacking them okay thank you Olivia thank you